Hello everyone, welcome to Waitani Hospital's podcast. In today's episode, we will discuss about how COVID-19 impacts the people with cardiovascular disease and how you can prepare for yourself or your loved ones. But today, we are very lucky to have our cardiologist doctor, Dr. Zaiden Buranasin, together with us to answer your most frequently asked questions. Hello, doctor. Hello. Uh, thank you for taking your time from your busy schedule to talk with us today. Hi, I'm Dr. Saida from Cardiologist uh, in Wishtani Hospital. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, doctor. So for the first question, uh, may I know what are the cardiovascular disease or their related conditions that can increase the risk of uh, severe illness in COVID-19? So if you have high blood pressure, mm-hmm. what we call hypertension, mm-hmm. If you have heart disease, such as coronary artery disease, yes. heart failure, congenital heart disease, pulmonary hypertension, mm-hmm. or if you have severe obesity, I you see. are at risk of severe illness of course, COVID-19. I see it. So, doctor, could you explain how does coronavirus affect the heart and circulatory system? The severe viral illness will mm-hmm. increase the demands on the heart. Yes. And when the virus goes into the lungs, the oxygen level circulating the body decreases, so the heart works harder. Mm-hmm. Rarely, but potentially life threatening, sometimes the virus could cause inflammation directly to the heart muscle. Uh-huh. It becomes weak, leads to heart failure, mm-hmm. heart rhythm problem, and increased risk of death. Oh, I see. So uh, I also found in the news that many COVID patients, they develop blood clots during or after contracting with COVID-19. Is it true, doctor? Or if it's true, could you explain why that happens? It is true, sadly, but true. Mm-hmm. COVID-19 can cause severe inflammation, which can trigger your clotting system. Mm-hmm. One of the way your immune system works Mm-hmm. reacts to an injury like when you fall and you have an open wound to your knees is making your clotting system more active so when it's more active like you get COVID-19 the patient develops blood clot I see mm-hmm. so uh, for the vaccines doctor so can the patients with uh, heart disease be able to get COVID vaccines safely doctor yes yes you can just continue taking your medication as prescribed mm-hmm. So uh, may I know your recommendations or instructions for the patients with cardiovascular disease before they receive their COVID vaccine? Okay, Uh, so in heart patients, I would say firstly, Mm -hmm. get treatment for your existing heart disease. If you have coronary heart disease, heart failure, hypertension, Mm -hmm. get it under control. Secondly, ask your doctor if you are taking a warfarin, which is a drug for heart disease, Mm Ask the doctor if you are safe to go to vaccinated. I see. Yeah. And thirdly, uh, refrain from vigorous activities and mm-hmm. get enough rest one right. or two days before and after the vaccination. Oh, I see. Okay. So uh, can you also share some, your, some of your advice or your recommendations for heart disease patients, how to prepare and protect from COVID-19? Doctor? So... Do all you can do to prevent getting infection in the first place. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Yes. Properly vaccinated mm-hmm. and watching mm-hmm. uh, physical distancing. Okay. Just do everything you can. Okay, doctor. Thank you very much for your time. <clears throat> and it's a very good explanation and recommendations for the heart disease patients, doctor. So, all right. That's it for today. I hope most of you will get valuable information from our podcast. So if you want to hear more useful healthcare knowledge and tips from our experts, don't forget to follow us on Spotify and subscribe to our YouTube channel. See you in the next episode. Sawadee Sawadee